Friday, November 15th, 2019. This is Joe Smith on Joe Smith Radio Network, and this is the news. 17-year-old has to have a double lung transplant, both his lungs replaced, from vaping. Yes, vaping, so there you go. Is vaping safe? No. Uber is being fined by the state of New Jersey $649 million in back taxes and interest claiming their taxi drivers are employees and not independent contractors. Okay, Joe Smith seriously disagrees with that. <coughs> They're claiming that Uber controls when they work and how many hours they work. Really, because that's not how Joe Smith heard or it works. I mean, Joe Smith never don't have any experience driving for any of them or nothing. But but does Uber tell anyone they have to accept this passenger? No. Do they set the hours they have to work? No. A lot of these drivers are also driving for Lyft, the competition. They might be doing some of these food deliveries at the same time. And they're more than welcome to advertise themselves and, and find their own customers. But the state of New Jersey is saying that, well, because they, the ones that don't do that, even though they can, they, uh, it means they're employees. Oh, well, that's not right. Just because they choose not to doesn't mean they don't have that opportunity. Many of them just don't care about trying to find their own customers. That's why they're going through Uber or Lyft. So they're trying their own taxi service. As they know, they make even less on their own. And they're claiming that while well, they were sitting and waiting a uh, half an hour for their next customer, they should be getting paid for that time. Okay, well, what did Joe Smith is saying in the more repair shop waiting for his next customer who's going to pay Joe Smith for that time. Next customer, so next customer, hey, you got to pay extra $10 on your more repair to because Joe Smith didn't have a customer in the past hour. Uber drivers are complaining that some weeks, uh, well, they have a car breakdown, and once they fix that, they can't even make minimum wage. Well, that's the cost of doing business. Write it off on your taxes. If you're not making, if you're not making enough money doing it, why do you keep doing it? How much money are you expecting to make when other people are out sweating their butts off mowing lawns for $10 an hour and you're just sitting around munching potato chips in an air-conditioned car all day? Your car's too uh, expensive to operate, then get a cheaper one.
called a business decision. Should it be the government's responsibility to tell you how to run your business? So you can make money, you're supposed to figure it out on your own. Or quit. Well, that's all that I just missed by here this morning. Thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned uh, this evening, 6 p.m. Central Time, on Joe Smith Radio Network for another Canada Week. Name that tune. And, of course, uh, Bear, Tool Bear is live streaming Sunday night, 6 Central. Or no, not 6 Central, 8 Central, 6 Pacific. Maintenance Man might be doing another live stream tonight or tomorrow night, so look him up and check him out. Otherwise, it's been Joe Smith, and that has been the news.